here guys, it's Attack on Samurai, and here is another Wi-Fi battle for you guys, this is Wi-Fi battle number 29, and this is against Lindemar, again, <coughs> so, he's got a new team this time, uh, Landorus, um, Landorus, Ferrothorn, Keldeo, Jirachi, Latios, and Sableye. So, yeah, pretty cool team actually. And I still have my uh, Mega Pinsir team. So, uh, the way this team was actually very, very hard to break. It was, it was, a, it's a very, it was a very hard battle <laughs> for me. A very, a very hard battle for me. Um, but you'll see what I mean. So, uh, yeah. <clears throat> So, I believe I actually start off with, okay, so I start off with my uh, Garchomp, uh, Trackstar, as he starts off with his Sableye, suck my roof, <laughs> suck my roof, <laughs> yeah. um, so, I'm gonna switch out, and not wanting to get burned from this thing, and I'm gonna go into my power line, expecting him to go for a Will-O-Wisp, um, as he actually Mega Evolves his Sableye, so Mega Sableye's here, guys, so, he, go, he goes for the Willowisp, as I thought. Um, so Paraline does take it. Um, I, again, I, um, I can heal build this uh, burn off. I, mean, I, I think I heal build this burn off at some point. But I'm gonna go for the Skull, trying to get a burn on him. Unfortunately, I do not. So Sableye is just gonna uh, Calm Mind on me, which is actually very bad. Um, as in Sableye can just take any hit and it would just be really annoying so yeah so I'm gonna keep so I think I just keep trying to fish for a burn on him so yeah I'm gonna keep scolding so second skull no burn it's you know for a dark pulse it's actually gonna be a decent amount to me yeah I did a decent amount um yeah I'm gonna keep keep trying to uh weaken this thing a little bit and trying to burn him as now he switches out his stable eye, probably for his uh, Ferrothorn, as he does switch to Ferrothorn. So I'm gonna go for the skull. Um, hopefully I do get a, I think I get a burn on this one. I think. Okay, no, I don't. So unfortunately, I did not get a burn on that Ferrothorn, which again does suck. So yeah. Um. So the burn is going to take me down to the yellow. So I'm going to go for a bolt switch to put myself in a better position. As I think his Ferrothorn actually goes Stealth Rock. I think he goes Stealth Rock right here. So I'm going to go into my Jirachi. Um, to try and get my Stealth Rocks up. As he does go for Stealth Rock right here. So that is very unfortunate for me. Um, the Stealth Rocks are really mess me up. And so will that Stable Eye later on this battle. So yeah, he's gonna go for protect as probably predicting a fire punch or something. But I'm gonna go self rocks. So I'm gonna set my my own self rocks on the Ferrothorn. Um, so that's actually that was actually a pretty decent play for me. Um, so now I'm gonna switch out, and I believe I go into trap. Star. Yeah, I go back in trap star. Um, as he uh, goes for a leaf seed right here, predicting a switch in. So that was a good play for him to go for the for the uh, leaf seed. So now Ferrothorn's gonna get some health back, um, which kind of sucks. But yeah, he's gonna protect and see what I do. So I went for the fire blast, and he's gonna notice that and go and switch out. I'm probably gonna go into I think he goes back into his. Um, oh, I go for the fire blast. I guess he went, and I guess he would see how much this would do. And it actually does quite a bit, and I do get the burn right there, so that was pretty nice for me. So, I'm gonna go for a gyro ball, uh, I'm gonna do a decent amount. So, yeah, I do snag the burn on this Ferrothorn, which definitely, I think it helped um, in this battle, I think it really helped. But, um, yeah, he's gonna get some leaf seed health back, um, but he's also gonna get burned, and he's also gonna you know, get a little down by burn as well. So I'm gonna switch out now wanting him to take more leaf seed help from me. And I'm gonna go back into power line. Um 
Yeah, he's gonna go for protect. Um, it does fail, unfortunately, for him. So, <clears throat> yeah. The fair thorn is gonna get some lefties to help back. Um, but it will get burned now. So, the burn will go over its, uh, health. Go over its, uh, left lefties recovery. So now, fair thorn is back to, um, half health. So, I'm gonna go for a skull. I actually thought he would switch out, but he did not. So, Ferrothorn's gonna go for Release Sheet, lands it, so that did suck for me right there. So that means that I'm, I think I suck Lantern to this Ferrothorn, I believe. I believe I do, because I can't really do anything else with it. If I, if I remember correctly, I couldn't really do anything else with this, uh, with this Lantern. So, yeah, Ferrothorn's gonna get some health back from Leaf Sheet. Um, and also some lucky help as well. Burn is still gonna take it down. So yeah, I'm gonna go for a skull. I uh, want to get him a little further down as I do bring him back into the hat. So he's gonna go for Leech. He's probably predicting me to. He's probably predicting to switch out. But unfortunately, I did not switch out for him. And I'm pretty much just gonna sack Lantern into this Ferrothorn. So meanwhile, I pretty much did sack Lantern into this Ferrothorn. So. Yeah, at least he is gonna take it and the burn will take on my lantern, which is unfortunate. But uh yes the lantern is down. So yeah, so Lance so Ferrothorn is still with getting little down by the burn. So I'm gonna go into track star and scare him out with the with the uh, fire glass. Um actually I went outreach predicting the switch out, but he actually did not, which really did suck right there so yeah he did not switch out so Jaro Ball will take out my uh, Garchomp so that also sucked for me <laughs> it really really did suck for me so now Ferrothorn is still a little lowered um but Burn will go over the um, leftovers recovery so I'm gonna go into Spin Jitsu and I'm wanting to try and rapid spin these stealth rocks away. Um, and Sunday's gonna happen too. But he, I mean, well, I actually thought he would switch back into, um, back into Sableye, so I predict, so I was hoping I would get the prediction right. Um, as he actually does switch out, and he goes back, and he does go back into the, uh, Sableye. So I did manage to, um, scare him out with the, was getting jitsu. So he's actually gonna double back and I think go back in the Ferrothorn. He is gonna go back in the Ferrothorn. Um Ferrothorn is gonna take some uh rock rock damage and player up is going to take out this Ferrothorn. So Ferrothorn's gone. I am gonna take some iron barbs damage which does suck for me. But yeah so Ferrothorn's down. So he's gonna go into the uh, Landorus, which Landorus definitely does scare out um, the Zoomerol. So, I believe I switch out now. And I wanted to take a knockoff or anything from this thing. I'm gonna go and spin Jitsu and intimidate him. Me and intimidate him back. And I'm gonna take some Rock Hunt and some um, Duck Rock damage though. As he goes for the U turn, and I believe he goes back in the stable line. So, yeah, so like I said, in this battle though, the uh, Sableye and the Landers have been pretty annoying. <laughs> they were pretty annoying in this battle. So, yeah, um, Sableye's gonna get some uh, self rock damage on it, and I'm going to switch out. Um, gonna go back in the bow. Oh, actually, no, I go into uh, Jirachi right here. So Jirachi's uh, focus hash will break, unfortunately. As he actually goes for the recover right here. So that definitely did suck right there for me. So I'm gonna go for a flash cannon. I actually thought he would have switched out, but he did not. Flash cannon's gonna do a decent amount. I am gonna uh, lower its special defense, which is very nice. He's just gonna go for the willow. And now uh Jirachi does have some uh, residual damage on it, which definitely did suck for me. So he's gonna switch out Sable Eye. Gonna go back. I mean, gonna go into um, his own Jirachi right here. So I can't really do anything to this Jirachi with my own Jirachi. So 
Flash Cannon not really gonna do that much. Um, as he does, as he did reveal the leftovers, so that told me that he was probably like some kind of, you know, well, he was an offensive set, um, with lefties, so. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna switch out, gonna go back into Spinjitsu, uh, just wanting to see what kind of Jirachi this was. Um, so I, so I am gonna intimidate him as he goes for the substitute, so. Yeah, substitute Jirachi, that was something I never expected to see, so. Yeah, substitute Jirachi, so. He's gonna switch out his Jirachi, gonna go back into, um, Sableye. Sableye is still gonna take some left, it's still gonna take some, uh, self rock damage though. And I did go rapid spin, but of course, Sableye is part ghost, so normal type moves will not work on ghost types. So I'm gonna switch out, I'm gonna go back in the bow and scare him out again. As I believe he actually predicts it and goes, no, oh, he actually went recover, okay. So Sableye went recover, uh, so now Sableye is pretty much back to almost full health, as now he's gonna switch out Sableye. And gonna go back into uh, Make a Wish, aka Jirachi. So I believe I actually went Play Rock um, on the switch in. Or I went Waterfall. Okay, so I went Waterfall. So I went Waterfall on the switch in. Waterfall does a lot to his Jirachi. And I believe I actually pick up the Kale with an Aqua Jet. I think I did. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna go for the Aqua Jet. And I believe this takes it out. Yeah, it does take out the Jirachi. So Jirachi's gone. Um. Now he's gonna go back into his Landorus, which I really can't do too much with. In mean, which um, I really can't, I really don't have much of an answer to his Landorus at this point. So I'm gonna switch back and intimidate him again with um, Spin Jitsu. Oh, actually, no, I go into my uh, Weevil. So I go into Weevil, um, so you know, for a U turn. And uh, yeah, U turn does a lot right there. So now he's gonna switch, gonna go into his Air Force, aka his Latios, and his Latios. Um, so I'm gonna make Evolve. I'm gonna try and get as much damage on this Latios as possible. So, I believe I went for the uh, Quick Attack right here. Okay, now I went Protect, I wanted to get my speed up. Um, but really, there was no point in doing that, so the Side Shock is gonna, me who's gonna go for the Side Shock right there. I'm gonna go for a Quick Attack. Uh, I'm gonna do a decent amount to his Latios. Um, actually, I actually did quite a lot though. <laughs> Not a decent amount, but quite a lot to his Latios, so... Pinsir did manage to get a lot of damage on his Latios, and plus a lot of life or damage as well. Just gonna rack up on it too. So now I'm gonna switch out. And sw so now I'm gonna switch into a Jirachi. As he goes for a Rooster right here. Um, I'm gonna get back to pretty much full health. As I go for the Moon Blast. And I think I take out this I, I think I take out but I think I take out the Latios. Okay, no I don't. I don't take out the Latios, but it did do a lot. I mean, but the Moon Blast did a lot to it. So he's gonna go for a Draco. And he's gonna try and take me out with a uh, with a life of Draco Meteor, which he almost did, but I live on like 18 health. So uh, yeah, getting off the moon blast, and that's pretty much gonna take out. He, and he's pretty much just gonna sack his Latios right here. So yeah, the burn is gonna take me out. So it's pretty much a double down right here, uh, which does kind of suck for me. I mean, which actually really sucks for me. So yeah, he's gonna switch. Gonna go into his my little punch. <laughs> he's gonna go into the Arcadia as I go back into Spinjitzu. Uh, which again, I really can't do anything with because the Sableye does scare me a lot. So, yeah, I am in a lower attack, but it doesn't really matter since Kelio is mostly a special attacker. So just gonna go back and see Suck My Ruby via yeah, Mega Sableye. So, I think I tried attempting to go for another rapid spin. Um, but yeah, it doesn't really matter. Actually, I didn't even fake out anything, so I went fake out. Um, yeah, he goes for the Willow, and can't really do anything with, uh, with hit with the uh, hit Montop because I have like no moves to actually hit this thing. But so he's gonna recover. Um, so I'm pretty much sacking uh, hit Montop to this thing. 
Okay. Yeah, and we get some, uh, get my citrus up. Um, getting the wraps, man. Not gonna matter. The silver goes. So let's see. Go for dark bulbs. Um, and getting burned. I just can't do anything to the save a lot. So, so dark bolts. Not gonna do anything. Green burn, so yeah, there's really nothing I can do at this point. So I'm gonna switch out. And go back to the stable. I'm gonna go back in the bow as he goes with the dark bolts. So I predicted that correctly. Um so now he's gonna so now I'm gonna go for a ice punch actually thinking he would go into the uh, lander so I got played. <laughs> should have went play rough. That was honestly the best play. That was honestly my only play. I should have went play rough, but I did not. And this play rough from a burn is going to will not take out this save one. So yeah. I definitely played that. I mean it made that play very that was a very bad play for me. Um I should have went either Waterfall or Clay Ralph since they were both stabbed. That probably was a, would have been a better play for me, but yeah, I'm gonna go for a water for an Aqua Jet thinking to take it out, but it does not. So, <laughs> so Sableye is gonna recover. Gonna get back to pretty much full health. Though it's gonna pretty much be whittled down to nothing. So I go for a Clay Ralph and land it. And again, it pretty much does nothing. Um, it's gonna recover. And yeah. So the museum rule is gonna die to the burn. Uh, which again does suck. And now all I have left is hit on top, I believe. Yeah, all I have left is hit on top. Which again I can't really do anything with, so yeah, I'm gonna intimidate gonna get a useless intimidate on him. And I'm pretty much gonna forfeit. So yeah, good game window. Um he definitely, he definitely played it very well. Um, definitely forced for switch ins and switch outs on my side, especially with the uh, hit my top. Like I really couldn't do anything to him. Um, as Landorus is just like really bulky, and the uh, Sableye is ghost, and I just can't touch it. So I mean, I just couldn't touch it with anything. So yeah, good game, Lindemar. So. I will see you guys in another Wi-Fi battle.